today is all about careers. A lot of times we talk about options for our students. Good morning, good morning, bienvenidos, buenos dias. And today is all about career options for English language learners from Clearwater High School and Pinellas Park High School. We are very excited because today they will get to interact hands-on and face-to-face -face with many different academies, many different uh, technical uh, opportunities, career opportunities, get to ask questions to learn about what each one of them involves so they can make educated choices about their future. We are all about creating opportunities for students and making sure that our English language learners have as many opportunities as everybody else does uh, in Pinellas County. It is so soft. Here today we have many different programs from uh, St. Petersburg College, Pinellas Technical College, uh, Coast Guard, uh, Aviation Academy, many others are here as well and what the students uh, will see are uh, different veterinary programs, culinary programs, we have opportunities to talk with experts from the fields who have spent many many years uh, in these careers. Teachers from these fields get to experience for themselves what it feels like to be in that field. Uh, we're helping students explore the different career options and help them figure out what it is exactly that they want to do in the future. Today we're just going to have a little charade game um, about different careers. So they, they draw a career out of a hat, they have to act it out, and then we'll give them information about the salary, the, the degrees or certifications necessary to do that job, and really just help them explore different, different options. So you can write programs for whether it's for an Android phone or an Apple phone. We have three programs here, .NET, Networking, and Computer Systems and Information Technology. What's really difficult about those programs is it's really hard to show what we do, not unless we actually bring um, information and activities for the students to do. In um, practical nursing, the students get to engage with some of the learning props that are in the environment. You know, we have an IV center there, we have um, some displays of organs and parts of the body that students learn as they matriculate through the program. Uh, with Larco Fire Rescue, we're showcasing our fire cadet program that we have for high schoolers from the age of 14 up to graduates, uh, seniors in high school. And it's a really great program where our students can learn about the different fire operations and skills, and it helps to get their foot in the door for a firefighting career. So this exercise here, we're actually doing a firefighter relay race, so they have to get an idea of what the equipment feels like, the different uniform that they have to wear. And then they have to practice a skill which is called rolling the fire hose. Take it back to the chair. So I'm a part of St. Petersburg College Workforce Institute, and what we do is we offer certification classes. Um, short term, you don't have to be a college student. This can be anybody off the street. They can come, and they can learn how to fly a drone. They can learn how to get certified in a drone. They can learn how to make money off of using a drone, and everything like that. So today what we're doing is we're teaching the kids actually how to fly one and how easy it is. Beautiful. Keep going, keep going. Well, I really enjoyed this field trip. It was really amazing. There's a lot of career choices I would like to take. Uh, they all seem very interesting and I, uh, I really, you know, they're all inspiring, you know, how hard they work and, you know, I would really enjoy to, to work one day with their career options. Uh, the most interest I had has to be with the police, mostly. Um, they seem really, you know, focused on their jobs, you know, they, they go on the streets, risk their lives to help innocent people. Yeah, this event is super important because sometimes our kids, when they leave high school, they're a little lost and they not, they're not sure what to do. Some of them aren't totally interested in four-year university degrees. Some of them are, um, but it's just, it shows them all the doors that are open to them and it, it helps spark their interest, what, what they like to do. Um, many of them don't even realize what are they're interested in until they see someone who's passionate about it.